जय हिंद आई एम प्रकृति वर्मा फ्रॉम नीलगिरी हाउस एंड स्टडिंग इन क्लास टेन एंड आई एम वानिया रघुवंशी फ्रॉम नीलगिरी हाउस स्टडिंग इन क्लास नाइन फ्रॉम द एफ्स लैंड स्कूल टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू इंट्रोड्यूस द कंसेप्ट ऑफ स्मार्ट विलेज बस स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम डेयरी फार्मिंग इन डेयरी फार्म वी रियर कैटर्स लाइक काउस बफेलोस विच प्रोड्यूस मिल्क एंड इट कैन बी सोल्ड इन द मार्केट टू अर्न प्रॉफिट After that, milk can also be used to make food items like paneer, cheese, etc. Now, the waste material produced by these cattle can be sent into the biogas chamber. Biogas chamber will convert it into biogas, which is methane, and it can be used in our house to cook food. After that, the solid materials which was left unconverted can be sent into the sludge digester. Sludge digester will convert it into into organic manure, which can directly be used in the farming. After that, the waste which is left in all this process can be sent into the vermicompost chamber, where there is presence of earthworm, which will eat it and decompose it into natural fertilizer, which can again be used in farming. Now here comes the solar panel house. In solar panel house, the solar panels are used where uh, where solar panel um, takes the sustain uh, renewable takes the renewable source of energy and then uses it in lighting up the streets. Now here comes the greenhouse. Greenhouse is a structure which is designed to provide sustainable environment, um, temperature and humidity to the crops. Here is here we can also see a reflector. Reflector consists of a concave mirror, which is a converging mirror. And in winter season, when summer rays are not very fluent, then the concave mirror corrects the summer rays and then con converges it on the greenhouse, which changes the temperature of the greenhouse and helps in the sustainable growth of the plants. In greenhouse, we grow vegetables, fruits which we use, and on the crop field, we use the millets. Or fodder, which is used in feeding the cattle in the dairy farming. Now, now the crops which are produced from the crop field are stored in the storehouse. Storehouse stores these crops from the and do, do not allow the spoilage of crops. It also provides the security to the crops. Now here comes the small scale small scale industry. In small scale industry, the products of dairy farm and other products like diyas or candles are manufactured and sold. On the top of the small scale industry, we can also see solar panels. The solar panels provide energy to operate the motor, which is connected between ponds and crop field. The motor uh, allows the water to move from pond to the crop field for the irrigation of farm now at last we can see the plastic decomposition tank in plastic decomposition tank the plastics which are produced from the small scale industry decompose there with the help of decomposing bacteria and um, they can be used they can be used as manure in the farms this was the concept of a small scale industry now question arises that why we need a smart village as we know that today renewable resources are depleting at high rate due to human greed so therefore smart village provides a solution to this problem now why this village is a smart village so this village is a smart village because this village Uh, because in this village we do farming which is organic we do not use any inorganic materials and also the products and also the products in these farms are recycled not any waste is generated now let us take of now let us take a tour of this smart village